सो हेयर कम्स द नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन लर्न टू सॉल्व पैरा जम्बलिंग क्वेश्चन इन लेस टाइम जम्बलिंग क्वेश्चन और पैरा जम्बलिंग क्वेश्चन आर दोज क्वेश्चन इन विच फोर और फाइव सेंटेंसेज आर गिवेन सपोज देर इज अ पार्ट ऑफ सेंटेंस पी देन आ सेकेंड सेंटेंस क्यू आ थर्ड सेंटेंस स्टार्टिंग आर एंड अ फोर्थ सेंटेंस नाउ देर आर फोर पार्ट ऑफ अ सेंटेंस और फोर सेंटेंसेज आर गिवेन नेमिंग पी क्यू आर एंड एस यू हैव टू अरेज दिस सेंटेंसेज अकॉर्डिंग टू द करेक्ट सेंस ऑफ दिस सेंटेंसेज सपोज द फर्स्ट सेंटेंस इज मैंशन the sentence is given here now we should the second part or the q option is because our coach the third is has not arrived yet and this is go home then there will be four option which will mention the correct order is p q r s the correct option is p s q r the third option is p r p q s and the fourth option is RQSP. So, I will not advise you to look after the options because the option might confuse you. So, whenever you are looking for this jumbling question or jumbling sentences, see the correct sense of the sentence. How will you make this sentence meaningful? The P part mentions now we should. Now we should. If we take this sentence as our first part then after this what this we is doing if this is the subject then there should be any verb or helping verb after this there is a helping verb should okay with we helping verb should is used but what is the verb here what they are going to do the verb there are two verb here arrived and go two verb verbs are given here arrived or go which verb should you use after this that will correctly match the sense or will make this sentence complete now we should has not arrived yet there is already an helping verb and if you are again using helping verb that will make no sense so we will go for second verb that is go now we should go home these two part of our sentence is making sense now we should go home then third is after if they are doing this action or if you are going to do this then why they are doing this why they want to go home the reason is because our coach they are mentioning the reason here why they are going home because our coach then this is another subject our coach yani their coach what there is another helping verb that is has when you are looking for subject you will quickly search whether there is any helping verb or verb which should be used after this subject after this subject there is a verb helping verb that is has and the second verb which have, which we have found earlier that is arrived now if we look to the sentence now we should go home because our coach has not arrived yet when we are solving this sentence this jumbo sentence part by part we will easily get the correct option as according to us the correct option is p s q r now we will look whether this is the option in the options given below or not the first option is p q r s which is not according to our option the second is p s q r yes we have found the correct answer how we will not go to the option first but before that we will see the sentence and try to complete it by ourselves if it is not possible or you are not getting the answer by your way then after that you will go to the option or you can take the help of the option and if 
you want to this question, uh, solve this question quickly as soon as you found the first word that is the first sentence is starting with p now we should after that there are three options q r s either you can use s after p you can use q after p you can use r after p go for the options which is having p at first place here it is p q r s and this is p s q r and these options are starting with r if you think that p should be the first sentence then please don't go for these option omit this options you will now not look on these options now there is only selection between these two options which is the correct option as soon as you get the second sentence that is go home now you are confirm that after p s should be used if you are confirm that after p s should be used go to the option which is in which there is s after p in this option s is after p and c is q used after p is making sense now we should because our coach no these two sentences if put together are not making any sense then you should not go for any other option you are simply getting ps according to your option or according to your choice then see is q and r used correctly if you put q and r here is your sequence correct and if the sequence is correct or you are getting a meaningful sentence then there is no need of looking any other option so if you want to save your time while solving para jumbling question then try to look for the say first sentence or the basic sense of this four sentences or when we read this four sentences collectively then you will know what is the sentence about or what is there in this sentence what they are asking or what they want to tell to us so when we see there is th that this is the only the first sentence apart from these sentence there may not any other sentence the we, we cannot mark this sentence as first or this as first or this as first this is our first sentence then go for the option which is having p in the starting you will not look any other option or looking any other option will only kill your time or waste your time so for saving your time find the first sentence then according to look for those option which is having first sentence at first place then choose your option according to that this is, this was an easy question an easy part but sometimes the questions might be like the first part of any sentence is given and the last part of any sentence is given like s1 is given and s2 is given this type of sentence is also asked in this type of para jumbling questions are also asked in some competitive exams that initial sentence is given and final sentence is given and between those sentence you have to put four options p q r s and similarly the option will be same either p q r s or p r q s or r p q s or s p q r so this question in this type of question you are having the first line you are having the last line you have to only arrange this sentence according to the sense of this first and last sentence or you have to make a meaningful sentence so look the first sentence and try to look after this sentence which option should fit correctly and as soon as you find the first sentence go for the option because if the sentence must start with p go for the option which is having p in the starting then what should be the next as soon as you find that there is difference in second option then try to look which should be the second option is q should be the second option or r should be the correct option as soon as you get the second correct sentence whether it is q or r there is no need of seeing any other option if q is correct then go with p q r s and sent complete this sentence if r is correct then go for this option there is no need of seeing any other option if this is the correct one so this will save your time and you can easily solve these questions 
So, when you are solving para jumbling question, read at once what is the sense of this sentence, what are different sentence. If you are getting the sense, you are getting the meaning of this sentence, then it will be easy for you to attempt this question in very less time. Thank <music> you.